Meghan Markle could have a baby boy when she gives birth to her first child in just weeks according to an old wives' tale retold by a midwife. The claim was made by Amanda Boot, a midwife from Groovy Babies. A way to foretell the gender of an unborn child, Ems Boot explained, is to assess the way the pregnant woman carries. She said some old wives' tales claim if you're carrying wide and low and have gained weight all around your abdomen, then you're having a girl. Meanwhile, if you're carrying high and pointy you're more likely to have a boy. However, remaining skeptical of the method, Ems Boo told Body and Soul, but I don't think there is any research that has ever been done to credit this. Still, that hasn't stopped people from speculating on the gender of the Duchess of Sussex's first child and newest arrival to the British royal family. Ever since she announced she was pregnant last year shortly before going on her first royal tour with husband Prince Harry, Meghan has been under the spotlight with all eyes on her growing baby bump. According to Us Weekly, during an event on her Harry's Australasian royal tour, a student said to the father-to-be, I'm predicting it's going to be a boy. Apparently, Harry laughed and replied, everyone is predicting it's going to be a girl. Ems Boot explained those predictions may be based on Meghan's bump but added a baby's gender is, in fact, nothing to do with the way you carry. She said women carry differently because everyone's body is as unique as a fingerprint. However, there are other factors which can affect a mother's baby bump. Ems Boot said a uterus is pear-shaped for the first birth, but becomes more apple-shaped for subsequent births, which can affect the appearance of the baby bump. Kensington Palace had disclosed the Sussexes are expecting the birth of their baby sometime in the spring but given no details on the child's sex. If Meghan and Harry's baby is a boy, it will have the surname Mountbatten Windsor and be and be known as the Earl of Dumbarton. If it is a girl it will be known as Lady Mountbatten Windsor. There was speculation Meghan wanted her baby to be gender fluid. Piers Morgan who was friends with Meghan Markle before the royal sacked him like a sack of spuds after meeting someone more important claimed the Duchess could have a gender-fluent baby. The outspoken Good Morning Britain host wrote in the Mail on Sunday, the Duchess of Sussex has her baby on April 1, and in a sharp break from royal tradition declares her new arrival is gender-fluid and will be known as both Oprah and Oliver.